Hi, this is Rob. We're going to graph absolute value functions on the TI-84 Plus CE graphing calculator. Remember, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel. We're going to do three different problems. The first problem is this, f of x equals the absolute value of x plus 1. Press the y equals key here. This screen appears. If you have any equations here from previous problems, Make sure your cursor is on the line that you want to delete, and delete it by pressing the clear button. Now we're ready to enter the absolute value function. Press the math key here. This window appears. Go to the right to num. This window appears. We want number 1 here. Press the 1 button or the enter button to choose this absolute value. It takes us back to here with the absolute value symbols and the cursor flashing inside the absolute value symbol. Now enter the x plus 1. The x is located here. This flashing arrow is still inside the absolute value symbols. Press the right arrow key to get out of the absolute value symbols. Now we're ready to graph the absolute value function. Press the graph button here. This is our graph. We can adjust the graph window by pressing the window button here. This window pops up. This x mim, x max, y mim, and y max indicates how many tick marks are currently showing on the graphing window. I'm going to change the x mim to a negative 10, the x max to a 10, the y mim to a negative 10, and the y max to a 10. And then press the graph button. And there's our new graph window with the absolute value function graphed. Let's graph the next absolute value function. Press the y equals button. Let us graph this absolute value function. f of x equals a negative absolute value of x plus 1. We can enter that equation here, but that will graph both equations with the top equation graphed in blue and the bottom equation graphed in red. You may want to graph both equations to compare them, but I'm going to delete the top equation by moving the cursor over to the right and pressing the clear button. Enter the equation. Enter a negative sign located here. Enter the absolute value symbols. Press the math key here. Move to the num tab. Press the one key or the enter key to choose this absolute value. Enter x plus one. Press the right arrow key to move the blinking arrow out of the absolute value symbols. Press the graph button. And there's the graph for the negative of the absolute value of x plus 1. Go back to y equals. Clear out that equation. Enter this absolute equation. A negative absolute value of x plus 2 minus 2. Make sure that you use the correct negative sign before the absolute value symbols and the correct minus sign for the minus 2. Press the graph button. There's the graph of the absolute value function. Okay, that is it. Press the second button, then the quick button to go back to the home screen. Here are a couple other videos you may like. The first one is how to program the TI-84 plus CE for the quadratic formula. And the second one is how to calculate the mean, median, mode on the TI-84 plus CE graphing calculator. Remember, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel.